Hi, thanks for joining us. In this session, we're going to take a quick look at creating custom styles for use in Infox 360. First, we'll create a new 3D model style to use as city furniture or as part of your decorations. And then we'll look at creating a copy of a street style so that you can configure the roads in Infox 360 to look like your typical section. And we'll also show how to export and import these styles so you can share them with the rest of your team. Let's start with making a new 3D object style. Now, in my case, I want to use a Collada file I have of essentially a little Monopoly house. First, I'm going to create a new catalog by clicking the plus sign up in the top right of the catalog editing area. Name that file or name that folder and then double click to open that up. Now at the bottom, click the plus sign to define a new 3D model style. Click the little browse button and I'm going to go to a folder where I have stored a 3D Collada file. That's a DAE extension and click that to open up the Collada. Now I'm going to modify the anchor point and you can play with this after the style is made. So if you don't like the results, it's okay. And then I'll expand the dialog a little bit just so I can see what's reading into Infoworks 360. This makes sure I've picked the right thing and that the bounding box isn't showing something crazy or any sort of translation has happened that I'm not happy with. Now, simply name the style like you want it to be known in Infoworks 360 and you're done. To share that with the rest of your project team, up in the catalog editing area, click on the little disk to export the current style catalog. And you'll write out a JSON file, a style catalog file to wherever you like. Now you can place this on a network shared drive and the rest of your team can access that style. Now they'll need to have the 3D Collada file on their machine in the same path, but it can be easily done. Now to modify and work with a street style, I'm going to copy an existing style because I sort of like the sidewalk and green space style that's already in in Forks 360. Near the bottom in the style editing catalog, select the style you want. And then at the bottom in the style editing area, click the button that says duplicate the style in the current catalog. Now you can rename the style here. So you'll make sure you're editing your new version and not the old one. And then double click the style tile, double click the preview to open up the configuration dialog. Once you're in the configuration dialog, you can make the changes you want to make and create this style to reflect your street section, whatever you need it to do. When you're all said and done, click the OK button to close this dialog. And now you have your custom road section ready to share with the rest of your team. To import a style, you use the style palette again and the catalog editing buttons near the top. Click the import button and navigate to that JSON file we created earlier. Click open and now you'll see that style is part of your Infoworks 360 model. Thanks for watching this video. To learn more, join the Infoworks 360 community by visiting the website on your screen. There you'll see forums, the idea station for sharing your ideas, and Infra Tips, where you can learn more ways to make Infrax 360 a more powerful part of your infrastructure workflow. Thanks again.